welcome back Star Wars fans. It's Jesse from the Imperial Academy. Thank you for stopping by. If this is your first time watching, go ahead and like, comment after the video, and subscribe to my channel. Let's do this. All right, guys. So I am showing you guys something really, really cool for my collection. And if you are a audio video fanatic like me, uh, and when I mean audio and video, it's like a VHS, audio cassettes of anything of Star Wars that people record it. Um, just things like that. So I am a big, big fan of that um, when it comes to commercials or anything that was on Star Wars uh, that was recorded on VHS, which I did a lot back in the day. Um, mainly like in when uh, the was the Power of the Force toys came out, um, the Star Wars Special Edition stuff came out. I do have some things... Uh, that are on VHS uh, somewhere around my house, but I do have them. So a uh, really, really cool thing uh, some many, many years ago, uh, I'm going to say maybe six, probably five or six years ago, uh, my son was fairly small. I'm going to maybe say seven or eight. God, well, anyways, a long time ago, um, I read this uh, ad in uh, Craigslist. And I would always go to the free section to see if they have anything, you know, people are giving away Star Wars something or anything Star Wars. Uh, so it said free Luke Skywalker pictures. I'm like, hmm, free Luke Skywalker pictures. What do they mean by that? So I emailed the lady. Her name was Lisa. And really, really nice lady. Uh, emailed her. I told her I was interested in uh, the pictures. She goes, okay. Here's my address. When would you like to come down? And I set up a date. It was a Saturday. It was my wife and my son. Drive out all the way to Orange County. Uh, really nice neighborhood. So we go into the neighborhood. Horses are walking around. I'm like, uh, hopefully we are at the right place. I don't want to, you know, you know, be duped into something fake. So we get out the car, knock on the door. Uh, this lady, Lisa, answers the uh, door. I introduce myself and she goes, come on in, takes us to uh, the other side of her house after the kitchen and everything was laid out on a table and I was just like, wow, what can I take? I mean, what? I don't want to be like a pig and take everything, but what, uh, you know, what pictures can I have? So she was like, you know, I have other stuff for sale too. Uh, would you like to see? So I go, sure. And I step into her other room and oh my God. She started telling me she was the ex-president of the Star Wars uh, fan club. And I believed her because she had pictures of her and uh, Steve Sansweet uh, thing, Christmas cards sent to her by George Lucas, Steve Sansweet. She was telling me some great little, you know, Tad bits of uh, when she met Mark Hamill and how he was really nice to her and very respectful. Uh, she met Harrison Ford and he was kind of standoffish. So I was like, okay, I mean, is this lady pulling my leg? And she busted out with some the old Star Wars greeting cards. With, there were some with the uh, uh, Yoda or the 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 one with the R two D two and C three PO. She showed me that one. She also showed me the poster with the the hands. You know, the, the Return of the Jedi lightsaber. I mean, Return of the Jedi uh, poster where it's the hands and then the lightsaber. She was like, do you know whose hands are those? And I was like, I don't know. I think it was just, you know, some random person. She goes, no. That was George Lucas himself holding the uh, lightsaber. And I was like, what the hell? I'm like, are you? So I'm just like, okay, this lady's really putting me on now. So then she shows me all her stuff that she's for sale i mean vintage and i mean stuff that you will not find in the store or things that you've probably seen in books i so now i'm starting to believe this lady so then she was like okay well you know here's the stuff and then what i bought i'll do a separate video for this i bought a um star tours press kit from when they hit this whole dilly dally of uh, Star Wars when it was opening up at Disneyland. And it was just a really cool press kit. VHS tape, um, documents, and all this other stuff. Really sweet. 
so that we go back to her uh, living room. And I was like, wow, oh, I see you have VHS tapes and cassette tapes. I'd rather take those. And then I took the uh, the uh, Star Tours press kit, which was, I think, she sold it to me for like 20, 25 bucks. I didn't mind it. I loved it. So uh, I told her I want these VHS tapes, uh, the cassette tapes. And just because, you know, I love stuff like that. So she gave me a really good deal. Uh, I think she, I, I don't think I paid a lot for these. I know these she gave me for free. But what you're going to see on one of them will blow your mind. And a lot of you collectors out there will go crazy. So I'm going to start with the VHS tapes first. So let me go ahead and bring them in a little bit closer for you guys. So here is her little note. Jesse, here here are your videos. They both work. Lots of few stuff. Lego Wars is on part one. And I think something few. Okay. Uh, this one, uh, she told me that she was going to hold one for me because we're talk talking through uh, email. And these I obviously bought, but these she threw them for free. And this one... I may have bought it off or she gave it to me. I don't remember. It was, it was a long time ago. But she did have a little things put on hold for me, which was like a couple of pictures. But I think I forgot the pictures because I was so excited for everything else. So this is from 1993. Star Walking. Well, it says Star Walking. Australian convention and I seen a little bit of it and what was what it was is uh, I seen a little bit of it and it's just like a, a mini convention in 1993 in Australia which was really really cool I mean this was before the power of the force and I think before the um, three set VHS with Vader Stormtrooper, Jedi, Luke, VHS tapes were released. So, yeah, you can't really go wrong with that. I mean, hey, why not? It's free. Let's try to get this in focus. There we go. So, next is George Lucas. And I believe her last name was uh, Cohen? 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 PBS special, primetime Japan TV Super Life Adventure short clips. Let's open this up. There's the uh, tape. It's amazing what you find on uh, VHS tapes, you know, Star Wars, what people, what people have recorded. Star Wars, THX, THX sorry. Get tongue twisted. THX Disc Samples Exhibit of Star Wars Props, San Rafael, California. The props are kind of like the ones that when you've seen it, uh, maybe like six years ago, eight years ago, is um, the Star Wars THX, THX, sorry, San Francisco Props Exhibit. Uh, this was uh, kind of like the same stuff that uh, Star Wars meets imagination when they did the tour um, I think the first time when it hit California was 12 to 13 years ago and it recently came back uh, well not recently maybe five years ago six years ago probably so that's one of the tapes let's go to the next one Wait, why does that one say Australian? Okay, I think, oh, it's tape two. This is tape two of the Australian Star Wars convention. 1993 Star Walking. That sounds familiar. I think there was a um, documentary on this. Not on this, but a group that started this uh, thing back in that day. But I'm not sure. I think that was later on, though. I could be wrong. I gotta check it out. Let's focus this, guys. 
But really cool. I love VHS like this. I mean, if you guys have any, let me know. What do you have on them? Yeah, this is Star Wars TV special. Um, I don't remember what this one was. I don't think this any. This one doesn't have a, anything Star Wars on it. If I recall, because I remember one tape having some junk on there, like red something, red planet, red. I don't know. So let's go to over here. Where is that? Okay. So now here's the audio cassettes. Love me some audio cassettes. Now I'm pretty sure you can find these on, the, um, you know, YouTube, like the video. But here we go. Star Wars widescreen advert from UK. Harrison Ford interview. Great. So you see the little arrow, great science fiction, include Paul Verhoeven, I think. Uh, movie show news, Empire TV ad, 1993. Review, much to do. Ridley Scott, aliens on major influences. George Lucas on Star Wars trilogy. Ken Ralston, movie show review, much to do, plus Kenneth interview. And like I said, I'm sure you can find them. Uh, what's it called over there at a uh, you know YouTube or something like that Here's the other one remember guys comment like subscribe to my channel Mark Hamill on Gloria Gloria Honey Ford's radio show 10 to 1989 Mark Hamill on star sound cinema radio show 630 1988 QVC shopping show outtakes UK international slipstream career 210 1989 more on other side so let's go ahead and all right there's nothing on the other side and this one is Tail end of interview plus Star Wars test B commercials Showtime TV interview January 1983 at the Schubert Cobbit of Space Merv Griffin interview with Mark Hamill 1983 and the rest is blank. And so here's oh. AM San Francisco. Wow, she really did a lot of recording. This is so cool. Now, here is the one for all ages. Uh, the, I, I looked this up also some time ago, but there's nothing on YouTube uh, about this interview. I did transfer it from cassette to uh, digital just in case if anything would happen I have a copy of it and they do have transcripts online for this re interview but I don't know who has it who else has it who else has heard it um, I, it's really cool so all you collectors out there or digital collectors out there this is one for the books this is beginning of interview. First 10 minutes are missing. Okay? The first 10 minutes are missing. And actually, if you go to... I'll, I'll try to put the link down below. So you guys can go ahead and click on it. And it this interview starts off with... it's at, I think it's at a Mark Hamill's page. I think it's like a fan page for Mark Hamill. But his transcription online is the same transcription as this. This is a interview done here. Our 25, I don't know what that means. Hamill Ford interview December. Look at the date. December 1976. This was a radio station. There we go. Radio station. I think it was called KJLA. 
but I'll go ahead and put the info mount down below. Uh, it doesn't say on here, but it is a really intriguing interview because you can hear Mark Hamill and Harrison Ford really goofing off on uh, Star Wars, and they, they were kind of, you know, their interview, they weren't really taking it seriously, but they got kind of like serious after. But it was so cool just to hear them. And, you know, the movie hasn't even came out yet. Not even a trailer. Or maybe there was a trailer, probably. Because it'll be like, oh, it's coming to a, you know, galaxy near you, summertime. So th there was, must have been the original trailer that was out. But just to hear them talk about the movie that you don't know. You, it hasn't even came out yet. That's how cool it is. God, this is so awesome. So yeah, the the Lisa, I mean, she's legit. She had some really good stuff, some really good stories. She hooked me up with some really good VHS tapes. Uh, bought the um, Star Wars thing from her, the um, Star Tours press kit, which is so awesome. I got these audio stuff. I love this. So guys, thank you for watching. Remember, may the force be with you all. Check your VHS tapes. Tell me what you got. May the force be with you on. Take care.